Hey everybody, so another day. Another, another dinner time. Another dinner time. And, and uh, we're having a Stephen Lee day so far. And today finds us at Tennessee Jack's. And uh, we'll let you know how it is and um, follow us. Wings, shrimp, oyster bar. That sounds a little highfalutin. Highfalutin. That's us. Yeah, we're highfalutin. <laughs> <laughs> Got a nice little courtyard. Yeah. And a cool entrance. Smells good. Saturday specials. All right, let's take a look at this menu. Wings, appetizers, fettuccine, salads, seafood, sandwiches, and the flip side. Platters. And this is a look around. A look at Stephanie, who's looking off into space. <laughs> and they do have a beer menu. My house salad. Looks pretty decent. Tomatoes, cucumbers. French dressing. French dressing. Yep, you bet. I'll let you know how it is then. All right, I got the hamburger steak with onions and green pepper and the mac and cheese. And I believe that is garlic bread, but I'll let you know for sure. And of course, I'm getting along with my salad, which is pretty good. And, um, well, we'll let you know. So, Look at that. What'd you get? Philly beef steak with Swiss cheese, peppers, and onions. But, as you can see, that part of the plate is empty. Waiting on my onion rings. Yep, waiting on the onion rings. We'll see how long of a wait we have. Happy girl. Now I'm a happy girl. Got my onion rings. Onion rings. And it was just three minutes after my my beef steak came out. Banana pudding, caramel cheesecake, banana split. That one looks like key lime. Oh my god. Yeah, that's looks pretty decent. Alright, y'all, we're we're home from Tennessee Jacks. So we'll start with you. Okay. Um what'd you get? What'd you think? I had um the Philly beefsteak with Swiss cheese. It was greasy and um, I'm okay with the cheese being real cheese um, being, you know, all greasy. Um, but there wasn't a whole lot of steak on it. And then it of course had um, peppers and onions on it, which I would expect would have peppers and onions on it, but there was an upcharge, which was unexpected. And then I had um, ordered onion rings as a side. She asked me what side I wanted with it. And I was unaware that there was, she read off some, some sides and uh, I wound up picking the onion rings and then our bill, there was an upcharge for the onion rings. So I was a little perplexed. And um, the onion rings in my opinion were, um, a little flavorless. So what you, what do you think of the decor? The decor. The decor was like um, cowboy meets sports bar. Not unattractive, but um, 
we were set in a booth that was pretty uncomfortable for a big girl like myself and I felt like I was eating my cheesesteak on top of my chest <laughs> pretty much were it was, uh, it was a little uncomfortable to be honest it was very family oriented there was numerous um, young families with their children around and everybody seemed to be enjoying themselves and they did serve beer um, and they did have a basketball game on tonight which was entertaining but um, that was my opinion yours well so I'll start it off with um, I was hungry like super hungry uh, so hungry that I um, you don't take a drink I right know now. what you're gonna say I was so hungry I contemplated chewing on a slow-moving groundhog um, <laughs> he says that all the time <laughs> <laughs> so uh, it may have been better than what we had for dinner tonight <laughs> so I'll be honest with mine um, I got the hamburger steak with uh, green peppers and onions on it um, it wasn't bad but it also wasn't great it wasn't anything to write home about um, the meh yeah, meh, meh. meh meh emoji um, the mac and cheese again. It was it was okay. Nothing to write home about. Um, the actually the garlic bread that was on my plate was the best thing that they served. I thought. And your salad with French dressing. French dressing. I don't know. It's not every restaurant carries French dressing. Right. But so but the sense. salad was nice. Um, I don't have any complaints about that. It was fresh and and everything was good there. Um, the service was was good. I mean, I, it it wasn't bad. I've I've had the service that's been really bad at places, and it wasn't as good as I've had, um, but it was all right. Uh, the total bill ended up coming to thirty seven dollars and twenty six cents. Uh, there's a upcharge if you use your credit card, so it would have been thirty six dollars had we used cash. Um, you know, something to know if you ever eat here. Um, yeah, don't forget, something to know if you ever eat there is um, you might want to take into consideration how comfortable you're going to be sitting at one of their booths. Yeah. The bench was short. You know, um, the bench was short, the tables were high, and there was very little space to slide in and out. Right. On me, there was no space. <laughs> right. Right. So... Um, but this is our opinion. Right. Um, you know, I, I think, truthfully, I think there's better options uh, in the area. Uh, however, with that said, on well, Saturday night, there's not a lot open. Um, um, people like to close shop and be home with their families on the weekends. And yeah. almost everything, if it even bothers to open, closes by 5 o'clock. Yeah, so, um, you know, we had, we had talked about eating somewhere else. We had talked about going to uh, one of our favorite restaurants. But we've done videos there, and, you know, we wanted to try somewhere new for you folks to see. We consider ourselves experience collectors, so this just gets it chalked up to another experience. Yep. I'm grateful to God for our bodies being nourished and us having, you know, a wonderful evening together. Right. And um, we're not complaining. No. Don't get us wrong. We're we're not complaining. We're grateful that um, we've had the opportunity to share this experience with you and with each other. Yep. And um, that's that's what makes a Stephen Lee day. Right. So if you like this video, please like and subscribe. Um, subscribing helps out a little channel like ours more than you could know um and if you're ever in the area um do your own research and may draw your own conclusions to any of the restaurants that we've suggested or um that you happen to find on yourself and right. let us know your opinions yeah opinions are like assholes 
are like belly buttons. Everyone has one, unless you're an alien. <laughs> Have a Stephen Lee day. Have a Stephen Lee day. Until next time. <laughs>